I wanted to first kind of show you what I had in mind with this uh, solar panel kit uh, for what I was going to do with it personally. And uh, I'll show you what I had in mind, and that was to uh, kind of keep my truck battery while I'm out camping from going dead on me when I'm, you know, not paying attention and whatnot. And uh, get this uh, charge controller hooked up. This, uh, this kit comes with, uh, with a charge controller. And that makes it real handy to hook it up to uh, any, any uh, type of uh, connection that you want, really. Uh, any battery that you want to charge. 12 volt battery anyway. And let me get these uh, cables unwrapped here. But uh, anyway, here's here's the connection on the output on the output of the charge controller right here. Output of the charge controller, and here's the two, you know, the two clips right here. And then you would just connect them to your positive and negative terminals of your battery. Connect them just like this, and that's uh, that's all there is to that. Negative, positive. And uh, we do have we do have the battery lights. The LEDs have lit up, lighted up. Uh, it's hard to see because I'm in the direct sun here. But now we'll connect the panel uh, to this side. But uh, for the purpose of this uh, demonstration, I will connect up the panel real quick. Okay, connect up the panel here. And let's see what we get here. Okay, we do have uh, it charging. So that's all there is to that set up there is uh, out of the panel to the control panel. And then these uh, alligator clamps right here connected to the battery and that's all there is to it. Now I figure let's test out how much uh, output power and everything we're getting out of this by connecting it to my portable power station now. Okay just wanted to kind of show you what we're going to do now is this is the uh, connection from the solar panel controller to the clips here. I'm just going to unplug this right there and we're just going to set this aside and now we're going to plug this in and then plug in our connection here these are the connections to the portable power supply right here just like this plugging that in now you've got the the connection for for your power supplies but I'm going to uh, plug in a watt meter. Let me grab it. Let's go ahead and see which one of these is the larger one. I don't even know. Here is my power station. I've been using this to make uh, ice today. And uh, let's go ahead and plug it in. Okay, now we've got readings. Okay, let me just put this up here. So hopefully we can get some, some shade here. I'm not sure that we can read that. Holy smokes, that is really good. And the sun is just blasting. This is, yeah. Okay, there we go, now we're charging. Okay, so this thing is charging. And uh, so let's kind of go over what I did here to switch it to switch these panels to charging this device. What I did is I disconnected the external charge controller that it came with, set that aside, connected the, um, I don't know, this is pretty long. This might be like 15 feet or something. Connected 
the cable direct to the panels. The panels are just laying on the ground right here on my carport. And I connected the adapter that they provided right here, connected this, and then plugged that directly into my watt meter. And let me tell you, if you can't read this, let me tell you what we're getting here. We're getting 4.89 amps. Um, about, yeah, 4.9 amps, 13.2 volts, and 64.6 watts out of a single 100 watt panel. That is, uh, that's better than I was expecting, for sure. I was expecting somewhere around 50-ish watts, um, 50, 60 watts, and uh, we're getting better than I expected. If I, uh, you know, spent the time to point this, point these panels a little better, you know, of course you can tweak this. Yeah, see, just moving it that much, that's already 60, 66 watts right there. And uh, that's kind of uh, how it works right there. But anyway, that's how this uh, panel works. We tested it. It works fantastic. Uh, it comes with plenty of cable. It comes with everything that you need to connect this panel to multiple different devices. It's a pretty sweet, pretty sweet setup. Let me know in the comments what you think. I'm, I'm pretty happy with it. I'm pretty impressed. Uh, if I didn't answer any questions that you might have, you know, drop them in the comments and I'll get back to you and answer them. As far as a kit goes, I mean, this kit comes with everything that you need to plug this into to just about anything that you could think of. If you wanted to make your own battery bank or you already have an existing um, battery that you're using, this is the kit to get. All right, talking to you guys later. Thank you.